In this video, you will learn how to render a wall. The tools that you will need are mortar pan, trowel, square, spirit level, straight edge, plumb bob, wooden float and metal float. The material that you will need is cement mortar. Don't forget to use personal protective equipment including safety gloves, reflective jacket, safety helmet, safety shoes and dust mask. Rendering or surface finishing refers to the application of a render made of cement, mortar or plaster to form a protective layer on masonry structures. The advantages of rendering include better waterproofing, improved fire rating, as well as a more attractive appearance. Begin rendering on a clean and soaked surface. Make a small amount of mortar paste and apply a 10 mm patch on each corner of the surface that needs to be rendered. These reference patches will guide you to achieve a uniform thickness. Ensure that the mortar patches are all equal in thickness using the plumb bob and straight edge before allowing them to set. Use a straight edge and mason square to ensure that the reference patches on either wall are at 90 degrees to each other. This will ensure that the finished surfaces are at a right angle. Scoop up mortar from the mortar pan using the trowel and flick it against the surface of the wall with a quick motion of the wrist. Repeat the process till you've reached the desired thickness of mortar. Once the mortar has been applied on the surface, use a second straight edge to level the mortar. Hold the first straight edge firmly in its position using one hand. With your other hand, use the second straight edge to plane the surface vertically in line with the position of the first. Check the vertical plane using the plumb bob. Use a horizontal sweeping motion of the straight edge to spread the level uniformly. Make sure you hold the straight edge without any tilt such that the plane makes full contact with the surface. Use a wooden float to apply pressure against the surface in order to compact the layers of mortar and fill any air gaps. Hold the handle of the wooden float firmly with one hand and position the plane against the surface without any tilt such that it makes full contact. Create sweeping motions applying light pressure against the mortar. Repeat the whole process on the second wall. Apply mortar. Level the sides with the straight edge. Check the vertical level.
Flatten the mortar holding the straight edge horizontally. Smoothen the surface with the wooden float. Now, use a metal float to create the final smooth finish with sweeping motions, applying little pressure against the mortar. Clean up your workspace using a broom. You have now learnt to render a wall.